Welcome back, one and all, to the Brexit Estate. Hard by the Darkest Dungeon, where it's time to try and take down another boss. Oh yes. Now, I'm um, giving this a fair bit of thought. Sorry, I should scroll up to the top there. And I'm thinking it's got to be either the Prophet or the Cannon. Okay? And whichever one of the two, the party's going to look something like this. We'll have Sister Wendy in third place. Um, where is it? Rosnav in second place. Sean in third. And... Either Roslyn or one of the Shieldbreakers in first place. Now, the cannon's going to be a bit tricky. I'm thinking out of the two, which are we most likely to need a healer for? I think actually it's going to be the Prophet. But for the Prophet, we'd want a Plague Doctor in the back to remove all the blight. Huh. Or we'll just go it like this. Okay. Let's take a look at trinkets. Does she have any move skills active? No, she doesn't. Okay. Move resistance is good. Profit doesn't really cause much move. You know what? And the pews aren't going to bleed. Oh, let's reorganize these straight away. It does cause a fair bit of stress. Um, that's good, that's good, that's good. Okay. Uh -huh. We do not have a good healing trinket yet. That looks so nice, but it's so, so dangerous. And you, on the other hand, it's all about resistances, and you could do the second trinket completely. All right. Honestly, I'm going to go with this for now. Do we have a safe camp. We do not have a safe camp. This is bad news. Okay. Right then. Skills. Oh god, level 2 skills. Yeah, I think maybe we don't go for a boss this week. Maybe we just take a mid-level party and try not to level anyone up to 5th. In which case we'd be looking at... Okay, that's very interesting. You know... I think this is going to be the one. I think this is where we don't She needs to wait a week. Do we have anyone? I mean, he'd level as well, you know. Uh, I mean, we don't have enough low level heroes for a low level quest. Um, 
fear of beasts are great. In a way. Hmm. What an awkward situation. Do I just send free level? Mm -hmm. Um. Uh, she probably. Flesh or the cannon, probably the former's flesh. Do you have a bit of a shortage of back rank characters? Hmm. And that's kind of why I think we need to just. Oh. Okay. Okay. Stick with the original plan. Painful vert, maybe. Where are you? There you go. Right. <sighs> okay. I'm gonna want that. I'm gonna want that. And you know what? Um. I do have Sister Wendy. Okay. Right. Let's go face the Prophet and hope that we succeed. It'll be nice to come back with some extra treasure and a lot of heirlooms. We're going for ruins, so busts are almost a given. Um, it would be nice to get our 50 portraits for the bank, but I don't think that's going to happen anytime soon. And regarding busts, none of the districts remaining need them. So that's okay. We need to start building up to complete the Abbey and the Insane Asylum. Right. Ah, uh, supplies. Well, obviously we need a lot of food. And torches. Uh, yep. You know... Okay. Here we go. Let's hope to get some nice treasure out of it. This raving creature had to be silenced. But doing so proved maddeningly impossible. How had he survived the stockades, the icy waters, and the knives I delivered so enthusiastically into his back? How had he returned time and time again to rouse the town folk with his wild speculations and prophecies? I love that line. And the knives I delivered so enthusiastically into his back. <laughs> and they're still there. Look, look, he's kept them. He hasn't taken them out. The echoes of his mindless tittering reverberate maddeningly. All right, so what we want to do in here... Nice. Nice, nice, is get treasure. Get out safely. Ambushed by foul uh. invention. We're gonna leave this. Okay, we're not going to leave this. Sister Wendy is... Well, she's not mortified, but she's... Ow! Oh. That's not good. So, a treasure room would be nice. Or a treasure chest. Anything with a lock on it, basically. 
Uh, but I'm thinking because Rosnav here is gaining extra stress, it might be worth trying to rush to the boss. Okay, we're going to... Okay, Sister Wendy's going to play with the torture device. Oh, nice! And then we'll wander into harm's way. You know, this looks a lot safer than it is. Okay, now they're all just picking on the same person. That's not fun. Let's protect them. There we go. Sister Wendy bringing in the healing there. And marking up a target. Nice. And this is the problem with him guarding when he's gaining extra stress against a bone noble. Now, right, set up that retribution. And you never know. Obliterated. Beautiful. Falls, a faint hope blossoms. After this one, abatement. I think we take on the crow for a week. Decimated. Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. We have uh, Sister Wendy there, wishes to bless herself to improve her chances of feeling closer to the Divine. The fact that she has already been closer to the Divine... Oh wait, no, maybe she... No, she... Yeah, her brush with death with the Crimson Curse has really like, given her something to think about. Okay, what have we here? A handsome reward for a task well performed. Okay, a slavering ghoul. What fun. Nice. Yes, he has dodge. And there we go. And let the blood flow. He's gonna go howl. Yes, he's gonna howl and give us all horror. Great. Yeah, let's put some more bleed on him. Nice. Oh, yes, that's bad. Blurred vision. The end approaches. <sighs> yeah, good old Ross now proving to be as tough as we expected there. That's always appreciated. And something else that's always appreciated is repost strikes. Yeah, now that's probably coming off before we can capitalize on it. Okay, that's not a good sign. Yeah, kind of gonna have to just start. Prodigious size. I was gonna say flagging him up. The sharpened blade. There we go.
treat this as a recovery round. The wounds of war can be healed, but never hidden. And then finish. Foolish horrors brought low and driven into the mud. Now we have room for a little more treasure. Not that we're going to find much more. Still no... Ah, okay. One, two, three, one, two, three. Hmm, well we'll press on in this direction and see how things turn out. Hmm. Finding the stuff is only the first test. Now it must be carried home. There's that how again. It's not a question. Otherwise it would be how must it be carried home. Oh, hey, fun! A pwn commander. Magnificent. Glorious. Not so glorious or magnificent. Probably gonna group strike anyway. No. Oh well. Got our attack anyway. Ugh. Right. You know, some healing criticals would be nice. Anytime soon. Oh, my goodness. Just because they're going for her so mercilessly. Oh, beautiful! He's still not going for his ground pounder attack. Lovely. Their formation is broken. Play it safe. Maintain the offensive. Oh, okay. Nice four there on the group heal. And well, there you go, nice little love tap. Just to keep his interest. Oh, here we go. Oh. Did those two attacks just miss everything? I think they did. Well, there we are. That's pretty much finished then. Okay. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. I'm not sure he can reach rank three. Oh, it doesn't matter, apparently. Oh. His dodge is not that great. Time for her to get angry, angry, angry. And then we'll see what we can do. You know, back during the Kickstarter campaign, the Bone Commander was going to be the endgame boss. And the Ruins was the only dungeon. This game's come a long way since then. How quickly the tide turns. Okay, that's unfortunate. Start. Oh, what a belter. What an absolute wallop. He pounded over there with his mighty mace. Impressive. But she returns in kind. I mean, you know, let's be fair here, she gives as good as she gets. A victory. Perhaps the turning point. Oh, that is so unfair. That's blatantly worth more than that. Um, right. Let's think about this for a moment. 
We're not going to get a scouting roll. doesn't help. Okay. Is that until camp? It is until camp. Okay. Oh, it's only dodge. Hmm. We're going to leave this, light a torch and press on. This might be a case of take the boss, then camp afterwards. I can't see what it is. Okay. Not worth risking a fight just for that. an interesting turn. That, I'm sure, is a very specific kind of party that would thrive on the use of such a trinket. Not just any party, but, you know, uh, maybe something like a witch. Please, Sister Wendy, don't... Oh, dear goodness. <laughs> She's going to have to get that treated at some point. What is this disease? To oh, tetanus. Okay, so it's only affecting her offensiveness. But then Sister Wendy is very old. Very old. Oh, fun! Well, okay. I don't have breakthrough prepared. Well, that's alright. Flip an egg. <laughs> nice. Just, just nice all round, really. The wounds of war can be healed. I was going to say, let's protect against the stress. Here we go. And she's paranoid. Great. The walls close in. The oh, Sean, what will we do? Paranoia there, eating buggy handles. Oh, that's just great, you know that? That is. That's, uh, that's wonderful. And Charlotte back there, she's saying, I can only trust myself! Oh, yeah, great, just give her more stress, because we really need that. We might have to pull back at this rate. Put him out of his misery and protection up everyone. A time to perform beyond one's limits. Let's see if performing beyond one's limits is exactly what Sean is about to do. Uh, 9 to 19, that's an 11 point spread. I find it unlikely, but you never know. Good critical hit chance. Annihilated. I should have more trust in her. And now the final foe is revealed. Well, have it then. In the face. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. <sighs> no. Tell you what, these keys aren't doing us much good. Go on, secret room, secret room, secret room. We do not have. Okay, it's only... It's only... Uh, protection until camp now. And so, right. 
we do have tactics. Okay. Ah. Uh, oh, that's bad. A nighttime ambush would be very bad for us. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. Well, we're not getting any funky treasure now. And here we shall camp. And live very dangerously. A spark without kindling is a goal without hope. Alright, from you, we want tactics. to a fine start here, aren't we? Let's see if we can duplicate that. That's a bit better. And then, because she's got a lot of stress on her, she'll now be receiving less stress for the next few fights. We've only got one camping point left. No one can benefit from that. Let's just hope we don't get a nighttime ambush. And if we do, let's do the best we can to put up with it. can be found in the most tenebrous corners of this place. And great. Not only are we ambush, but it's also spiders. Here comes all the pain, all the venom. Well, it's in keeping with the venomous theme of the prophet, at any rate. Her back there, and then he can knock one of these into next week. Apparently, no, he can't. Apparently, he's just going to be ineffectual and just flail wildly in the darkness. Okay, she's marked. That's a bad sign. Another abomination. Cleansed from our lands. Which means she shall soon be guarded. My mouth. It's all over the place. Okay, no guard, just a mace. Executed with impunity. As victories mount, so too will resistance. Okay. Well, that could have gone a lot worse, so I'm not going to complain. And I will press on now towards the final encounter. I don't think we can afford to explore much of the rest of the dungeon. Well, no, you'll fall victim to this trap as well. Ancient okay, then. Traps lie in wait. Unsprung and thirsting for blood. You know, in terms of being a low yield, this dungeon... Not the best. Look, as long as we get no food checks in this hallway, we're fine. Diminished. just in case he starts throwing skulls. Skulls for the Arbulest! Howls from the slavering ghoul! I remember when that used to trigger repost, and it didn't require damaging attacks to trigger. Nice! If only we could get something like that over here soon. Hey! You stop that! It's not very nice. I 
Oh, okay, I thought he'd actually bleed this time. I'm glad he didn't. Beautiful. That is... Yeah, that's gone next turn. Okay. Ow. Please don't stun. Hooray! And then a single target heal. There we go. Mortality clarified in a single strike. Little pain both ways. We have bandages. We do have bandages. Great is the weapon that cuts on its own. Oh. What's this? Shimmering Cloak. Oh my goodness. That's kind of a grave robber item, really, isn't it? That is uncommon. Okay, well, there's not much bleeding in that fight, so we'll just go like that. And then the goal is to beat down as many of the pews as we can for the extra rewards. Had to click on the door twice there. The madman hides there, behind the pews, spouting his mindless drivel. You know, her being paranoid doesn't make this any easier. I'm just gonna hack at that. All right, we can still do this. Because I'm gonna swap these two around. Okay, I'm not gonna swap these two around. She is gonna get brutally smashed and the roof falls on her head. Right about now. Yep. Oh, again? Come on! Oh, she can't go forwards. Great, 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 great. Flippin' heck. Okay. Do not refu- You're rubbish. And you know it. But not that rubbish. Ha <laughs> ha! Don't you dare. Terrible assault cannot be left unanswered. I don't like the fact he's able to just blatantly get the exact two needs here. Ah, oh, come on! Now you're just being horrible. I like the fact these pews are more sturdy than the lower level ones. Right. You, get healed. Everybody dodge now! Look out! The roof's gonna fall on you! Well said, Rosnav. Save their lives! And they get blighted. Wonderful. And the roof... Misses them both. Uh, he's gonna have to do a group guard again. Oh, wow. Still going. Right, she is going to... apparently shoot the one who's keeping her alive, which is not great. Then... Soften this one up. Right, she is blighted, but, um, solid. I don't think it can do 40. And I probably shouldn't have said that. Oh, poo.
Well, it wasn't 40. <laughs> this next turn is going to be interesting, or this next round. Right, I need you to chop that up into firewood. Lovely. You recover from stun. You recover from stun. You guard her, for she is vulnerable. And then here we go. Don't stun him. Good. Injury and despondence. Set the stage for heroism. Stalwart! Stalwart man at arms! <laughs> Beautiful! A brilliant confluence of skill and purpose. It's not much, but it all counts. The blood quickens. And now... Now he survives. Oh, nasty. Okay, another group heal. Great. Compassion is a rarity in the fevered pitch of battle. Oh, what? Well, she does seem determined to take a lot of damage here. Come on. Bolster their defenses. Yes! Please don't die. See, it's almost the Blight which is more dangerous from the roof. Yeah, the roof softens you up for Blight damage on your next turn. Vistas of emptiness reveal themselves. And speaking of being softened up, it's okay. Right, just heal. Her. Oh God. Right. In that case, group heal everyone else. This is, this is 14 dodge. Right. I'm going to guard her for his own protection. I can't mark him as a target because he gets so many turns it just doesn't last. And she's blighted on death's door. This could all end very quickly. Okay, nobody's dead yet. But she's got a turn coming very soon. Gotcha! You need to not die right Death now. It cannot be escaped. But it can be postponed. And apparently Windows wants to superimpose an update message over the game because it's being stupid. Right. I'll serve their defenses. It's okay. You're not under the ceiling. Well, you are, just not that part of the ceiling. That's okay. It could be a lot worse. And everybody lives to see another turn. Oh, you cruel, cruel creature. You horrible, nasty prophet. Foreteller of Doom. You know, he can repost against the Prophet when the roof falls down. Just saying. And it's nearly the end of the turn, so we'll do this anyway. She might go early next round. Okay, we go. Oh, goodness. And the ceiling will hit the inflicted one. Teetering on the brink, facing the abyss. Oh, oh, come on. Come on. <laughs> this is just sadistic. Whatever you do, don't die before you can be healed.
That's a start. Sometimes. More blood soaks the soil, feeding the evil therein. A pathetic waste of a crossbow, Captain. And stopped. Oh God. We need her to recover from that stun before we can leave. Because we are not sticking around for this. It's just too risky. Right. Okay, that's bad. Horrible. This whole run's been pretty disastrous. Cornered, trapped, and forced to fight on. Let us depart. And depart we shall. Great. Okay, that is spinning in a really One weird can way. Sometimes find clarity and madness. Uh, but I hope only rarely. I hope that skin gets updated at some point, but for now we are leaving. This has just been too harsh. And deadly. You will endure this loss and learn from it. And I spent all that money training her skills. Great. Just great. And he didn't cause horror once. I'll remember that for next time. And I'm sure there will be a next time, but Ah oh, come. Great. Just just great. Finally, the serum is working. <laughs> the side effects are manageable. Uh, and there was me thinking I wouldn't be able to treat the two diseases that had been acquired. Medical breakthrough. The time and gold were not spent in vain, however, as today's caregivers announced they have succeeded in concocting an effective antidote. The medical ward is free. Okay, Fatima now has the meditator quirk. That's fine. Korun is no longer faithless. Ulfred is no longer suffering a torn rotator cuff. We are going on a low level quest next week. But for now, we have people with diseases that absolutely need to be treating. No more spotted fever for you. And Sister Wendy, we just can't you have have you we can't have you having any kind of plague. Is there Anyone nice in the stagecoach? You know. You know what? Shoot, bandage, and pillage. The dancing steps of war. I'm feeling really uninspired. She's just going to be called Kelly. Not a bad skill set there, Kelly. Oh, she's got everything. Wonderful. Right. Um, yeah. Well, we're closer to that district being built. Yeah, that didn't quite go as planned, unfortunately. Oh, well. Hopefully things will go better next time. So with that, I'm going to leave it here. I hope you all enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye for now, and cheerio!